Hey everybody, give me a second. I'm trying to monkey around with my uh, um, mouse. There, I'm trying to figure out where the camera is. Where? Okay, I, you're up there. All right, so good morning. This is only five minutes. I know the last one was 30. I just want to uh, spend a couple minutes reflecting on some key terms um, that you guys used a lot in your discussion three conversation and I don't want to uh, decide those terms for you uh, I don't want to define them for you I just want to um, to challenge your thinking the first term that I heard a lot or I read a lot was unique this program was unique because this program had these unique factors unique is being the only one of its kind unlike anything else many of your programs may have in fact been unique the question is does that mean that they are also innovative to innovate is to make changes in something by introducing new methods new ideas and for our purposes innovation is present if those changes are a game changer if people that you were not able to serve before are suddenly serviceable if communities you were not able to reach before are suddenly reachable if methods that you had always used before did not make change and new methods are actually making hand over fist change that is innovation just because there it is unique meaning nobody else is doing it does not mean it is also innovative what I really want you to think about is what makes something truly innovative? What makes it a game changer? What makes it possible to do work that has not been able to be done before? Either brand new work that nobody had ever figured out how to do before, or scaling up to hitting so many more people, or doing it in a so much better way that the outcomes are just phenomenally uh, improved. That is what we are looking for when we are talking about innovate. What is creativity anyway? Creativity is combining old things in new ways. If you are at all familiar with biblical texts, I believe there is a, a writing that says, there is nothing new under the sun. I think it started with vanity, vanity, all is vanity, and there is nothing new under the sun. Anyway, um, what you're looking at, if you're not sure, are pasta noodles that are made from vegetables using a machine. I can't remember what it's called. Some of you probably remember what it's called or know what it's called. But it was the idea of taking something old, which is a, uh, a vegetable, and another thing old, which is something that pushes out pasta from pasta dough and using the vegetables in a machine that works the same way the pasta dough machine does so that people can have pasta dishes without being unhealthy. So there's nothing new under the sun. We innovate by using creativity, by figuring out new ways to use old tools for new purposes. That doesn't mean that everything that is innovative is new. It may be a combination of old things that when put together make everything better. And my last slide is this. Some of you brought some great programs to talk about that are not innovative and they're not new and they're not even unique, but they work. So. We're, a program that works is great. It doesn't have to be innovative. If it works, then don't fix it, right? Okay, so I want you to be thinking about these concepts as you are moving forward in the classroom. Is it really innovative? Is it just happen to be the only thing like it, but not necessarily innovative? Is it creative? Does it combine old things in a new way? to get to something new and better? 
or is it just something that works? That's it, folks. See you on the board.